Welcome to my vlog. My name is Shaleen Jackson and today I'll be sharing some information with you on the Child Protection and Family Services Agency, protecting children, empowering families, securing the future. The Child Protection and Family Services Agency was formed out of a merger of the Child Development Agency and the Office of Children Registry. It is the leader in Jamaica child protection system with a combined legacy reputation for their work in promoting child-friendly policies and groundbreaking program to strengthen families. The agency offers a range of services to children and families. The agency serves children between the ages of 0 to 18 years who are declared by the courts as in need of care and protection. Children who are awaiting the outcome of court proceedings and family experiencing difficulties raising their children. The agency caters to children who are at risk of being abandoned, abused, and neglected. Children in the care of the state, parents or guardian of children in the need of care and protection, children with special needs, Parents are guardian of children with special needs, children experiencing behavioral challenges. Parents are guardian of children experiencing behavioral challenges. Foster parents, prospective foster adoptive parents. Ob their objectives to instill a greater sense of care and responsibility among parents, improve communication between parents and children, and address behavioral problems at home in order to prevent children from entering state care. Their vision statement, the Child Protection and Family Services Agency aims to be an extraordinary agency in providing an atmosphere within which protection and transformation of our children, support and strengthening of family life and team members occur, allowing them to reach their full potential in a safe and nurturing environment. Their mission statement. Our mission is to proactively and responsively protect as well as provide care beyond limits to our nation's children through sensitive investigations and appropriate action love, advocacy, education, rehabilitation, and family support. Because we are committed to valuing our children, their families, and our team members. How is the public made aware of the roles and responsibilities of the agency? The ATI Act was passed into law in 2002 granting the public the right to access official documents held by public center entities. The Child Development Agency has embraced the philosophy of the public's right to know and has therefore cultivated a culture of openness and transparency through advertisement, social media platforms, education, Success in assisting children in my region. The Child Protection and Family Services Agency held its Educational Achievement Award, where awards of the state who did exceptionally well in their Caribbean Secondary Education Certificate examinations were awarded for their efforts. Clark achieved eight CSEC passes and is now reading for a Bachelor's of Science in Computing at the University of Technology in Jamaica. She was awarded the prize of Top Female Achiever for the Southern Region, which consists of Clarendon, Manchester, and St. Elizabeth. The top boy will also be pursuing tertiary level education, among others as well. The Child Protection and Family Service Agency are doing well with helping children and families achieving their goals. The 
The Child Protection and Family Services Agency upgrade plans include outfitting nurseries and the Merton Boys Home with sensory equipment, upgrading the telephone system to include upscaling the call center to facilitate 24-hour service, and the integration of the National Children Registry processes into the general agency case management system. The project, which started in 2019, is funded by the Inter-American Development Bank at a cost of U.S. $1.2 million, aimed to modernize the agency operation by 2023, and will see an improvement in system, systems across its network of offices and key partners. The goal of the project is to enable real-time access to accurate and up-to-date information to guide, advising, and to deliver effective and efficient services that contribute to the well-being of the children and families that they serve. Thank you for watching.